Lieutenant Governor Husted spoke at the Ohio Department of Public Safety's Law Enforcement Recruitment Summit. This event helped law enforcement personnel discover innovative recruitment tactics and develop strategies to successfully recruit the next generation of leaders. More than 100 participants from 55 agencies were represented at the summit, and 28 agencies attended the career fair the following day. Yeah, the Law Enforcement Recruitment Summit was really a success for us and the agencies that attended. We got several positive feedback from agencies just talking about how nice it was to have all of this recruitment and retention information in one space in one area. Uh, they really enjoyed the networking and the sharing of ideas that was focused on recruitment and retention. And for the fellow DPS employees and coworkers, I would just say continue to share our contact information. Uh, we're here to assist agencies in the hiring and trying to increase their efforts of uh, getting qualified candidates. Nearly 5,000 Ohioans died of unintentional overdoses in 2022. Fentanyl was involved in 81% of these deaths, often in combination with other drugs. This Saturday is International and Ohio Overdose Awareness Day. On Friday, teams from the ONIC were on hand at the main employee entrance to the Shipley Building to offer information and resources that could help someone that you care about. Substance use disorder does not discriminate. It can impact anyone from any walk of life. No one in Ohio needs to die of an overdose. Administering naloxone can save lives. To learn more, go to naloxone.ohio.gov, recoveryohio.gov, and onic.ohio.gov. Finally, let's see what's happening on DPS social media. This week, the Ohio State Highway Patrol Basic Class 151 began their journey at the Patrol's Training Academy. Basic classes are made up of cadets from law enforcement agencies across Ohio, and Patrol Academy staff will provide quality instruction in all subject matters prescribed by Ohio Peace Officer Training Commission. Don't forget to follow all DBS divisions on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. That's your weekly update. See you next week.